Okay, before I forget, let me speak on this topic. Um, you can't change people. You can't liberate them. You can't, you can't change their mindset. You can't change their way of living, the way of thinking. You can't change their human behavior. If individuals, people, community, a group, a country, a religion, whatever, if people grow up a certain way, that's the way uh, that they know how to live, right? They don't know any other way until they're exposed to another um, way of living. And, and by the time they're exposed, that may be too late. Uh, meaning, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. And I say this because I want you to think about this. Anytime that, we, that you think we're going to go into another area, country, and liberate people, they don't want to be liberated in the sense the way we live. They just want to be able to have a clean slate remove all Terra or previous government so that they can figure out a system that will work for them. I'll give you a more home-based uh, theory. You wonder why we, we can't or haven't been able to solve the homeless problem here in America, and it's gotten really bad, I mean everywhere. Of course it was bad in San Francisco, um, Many other states, uh, it's even moved to Texas and some of the major cities, bad. I mean, I think some of those guys came over here. But regardless, my point is, many people have already caught on to, these people don't want to change. They want to live this way. They want to live free or live homeless because they don't have to answer to anyone. They don't have to clock in, clock out. They don't have to be structured. They don't have to go work for their food. All they gotta do is stand on the corner and hold their hand out, hold up a funny sign, have some kids there, do something dramatic. A lot of them will have dogs, which will touch people's heart, and they're like, oh, the poor dog, let me, let me give him some money so he can feed his, himself and, or her dog, or whatever. They don't want to look to change or be liberated to be in a civilized society because it's too easy for them to live that way or they're accustomed to living that way or they've already adapted to living that way. They don't want to live any other way. They just want to find another system that will help them maintain that homeless lifestyle so that they can just live off another system, a structured system, a society, a civilized system think about it if people stop if they if they did away with food pantries um, if they did away with homeless programs homeless shelters if people would stop giving them money if they found themselves in a situation like we are starving we are going to die living this way they would then change and stop living that way. But as long as they have those four or five support systems, there's no need to change. There's no reason to change. Going back to my original point, which was liberating another country like Afghanistan or anywhere in the Middle East that we think, oh, we're gonna remove the powers that be, give these guys American freedom, American ideal uh, structure freedom. They don't want that. They never wanted that. They just wanted the handout to say, give us help, send help our way. Because if you think about it, if they really wanted to be liberated, why are they still dressed the same way? Why are they still dressed in that long nightgown? Why are the women still covered up their faces? If they really wanted to be liberated, they would have, when they had the opportunity to stop dressing that way, to have to stop covering up their, the females, stop covering their faces, they would have changed when we were there. They would have said, hey, let's progress to this. They want to keep their identity, but have their own freedoms. And this is why I, I butted heads, heads with some people where I say, if you want to come here, 
then you have to confine to American way, American culture, American standards. They don't want to do that. They want to come here with their ideal world of how they lived back there that, was, that they left because it was a shit, shit storm. They want to come here and bring religion, their ideal way of um, living. They want their women to still be covered up. They want to live by their religion, which is why we're over there because, you know, their, their idea of religion or culture is, uh, is so um, against us. They want their cake and they want to eat it too, is what I'm saying. You can't liberate people that don't want to be liberated. They don't want that liberation. They don't want that freedom. They want you to give them a clean slate so that they can do their own painting of their own ideal world and let them figure it out. And I wonder if one day that's going to be us and we're going to want to have our own idea of freedom or the way it used to be. Um, it's just crazy, guys. It's crazy. So just know that. All right. Got to go. Adios. Lots of news. Right out.